Hey, what's up, everybody? It's good to see you guys again. Today, guys, I am back with the two SML, guys. So today on this video, guys, I'm going to react to Jeffy's club. And let's go. Jeffy's about to have a club. Oh, man. Every time with SML always has a club or a party or anything going on that balls around dancing. Oh, man. Also, speaking of dancing, I did not forget about the dance marathon. Oh, man. <laughs> yep. It felt like a dance party every time they do the dance marathon. Yeah. But anyway, yeah. <laughs> that video was great. Yep. It really was. But I can't wait to see this one, guys. Also, I did remember in the SML question on the last video, guys. It had something to do with McDonald's and now that. But they also asked me a question about... What video should they do in 2024? And I said, and I, and I did the answer, guys. I said a dance party or something, and they actually did it. So good job, SML. I can't wait to see how this goes. This is probably gonna be a great video right here. Yep, I can't wait to see this. Also, now with that, guys, but I also posted that I got the curd frost meal, guys, and I enjoyed it, and I loved it, guys. It was actually pretty great, pretty good, guys. Yep, I did say in the very ending on the last video about my reaction to it, guys, and it happened, guys. Yeah, that was a great meal, and I really glad to enjoy it, guys. I hope you guys did the same thing where you actually got the curry frost meal, and also see the collectibles. Yeah, I got mine, but I'm not so sure if I should keep it or not. Let me know in the comments if you guys want to do with it. Yeah, but anyway. Before I get straight into this video, guys, I see you guys do me a huge favor and actually leave a like on this video. And most importantly, subscribe to this channel. Also, don't forget to hit the bell while you're at it, guys. If you guys already did all that, thank you so much. I appreciate that. Now, let's get straight into this video, guys, and see how this goes because, yeah. I can't wait to see this party going on. I'm so excited to go to the club tonight. Look, I got my dancing shoes on. I'll try to get jiggy with it. What's wrong, Marvin? I hate going to the club because guys are going to talk to you and then I'm going to get upset. Guys aren't going to talk to me, Marvin. Why can't we just stay home? Hey, Marvin, what's up? Yeah, we've been pre-gaming in the car on the way over here, so you're going to have to be the DD. The DD? The designated driver, duh. Oh my God, I love your outfit. Thank you. I love yours. Marvin, what the fuck are you wearing? A suit. Why are you wearing a suit? We're going to the club. You're not going on trial. You're not holding a press conference. I thought it looked nice. No, you look like her dad, especially because she's dressed like a child on her way to church. Pointy, cut it out! No, that's fine. If they want to be embarrassed, let them be embarrassed. What am I supposed to wear? This drip swag, you know? I look like I have chlamydia. You look like a goob. Hey, Daddy, where are you guys going? We're going to the club. Ooh, can I go? No, it's for adults only. Well, I'm 19. Yeah, sorry, kid. It's 21 and up. But you're a cop. Can't you sneak me in? No, because then it would be a total sausage fest. More for me and you, right, Marvin? We're married. Yeah, sure we are, buddy. Okay, everybody, to the club! Let's go! <laughs> okay, fine! I'm gonna start my own club, and none of you will be allowed in it! Oh man, Marvin, this club is lit. It sure is. Oh my god, I love this song! Me too! Okay, Marvin, now that the girls are distracted, let me know if you see any hot babes. I think I see one over there. Ooh, good eye, Marvin, good eye. Now call Batman, because the Rizzler's here. Hey, Brad, come dance over here with me, bruh. Okay. Hey, ma'am, I don't like to watch sunsets, but I'd like to watch you go down on me. What? If I flipped a coin, what are the odds I'd get head? Huh? Uh, I'm in college, and normally in class, I try to get an A, but with you, I'd like to F. What? Hey, I lost my keys. I think they're in your panties. Can I look in your panties? Brad, he's trying to get in my panties. Hey, you hitting on my girl? Bro, yeah, so what if I am? Do something. No, guys, don't fight. Oh, my boy Marvin's here. He's gonna kick your ass. No, I'm not. You wanna fight, bro? I don't wanna fight. Oh, yeah, he wants to fight. Marvin called you a pussy, and he said your breath smells like cat shit. Don't talk about my breath. <laughs> Marvin! I think we should leave. Bro, are you kidding me? Brooklyn guy, fuck you, man. Are you serious right now? Seriously, bro, you are a fucking pussy. You are, man. Seriously, the last time he did this before, guys, it was back when he had Boys Night Out. And he already got Marvin beat the hell up. Seriously, I keep seeing Marvin get beat up so many times that he didn't deserve it. I mean, I feel bad for him how much he's been suffering for all this. I'm like, fuck Brooklyn guy. He's a fucking pussy. We already know he can't fight. 
And also, if I'm in a party and all of a sudden someone really wants to really wants to fight me for no reason, there's no reason for me to fight because I didn't start anything and I didn't do shit to, towards them. Seriously, I came here to party. I didn't came here to get into a fight. Seriously, I'm not trying to get arrested. I'm not trying to get kicked out of the club or anything like that. I just want to have a good time. Don't you guys? If you guys ever been to that experience, let me know in the comments. <laughs> Jeffy, what are you doing to the playroom? Well, my mommy and daddy went to a club and they said that I couldn't go. So I'm starting my own club and it's going to be called Club Jeffy. No adults allowed. Aren't you 19? Yeah, but I'm going to be the only adult allowed here. Kind of weird, dude, but we're not going to judge. So what's all this stuff? Well, I got disco balls, a disco penis, and a bubble machine because hoes love bubbles. Hoes do love bubbles. Everyone in the world's going to want to come here. Well, hopefully not too many people. I mean, we're going to have to get the fire marshal in here to see what the capacity of this place is. Otherwise, it's a fire hazard. Dude, you should not be allowed in here. What? Safety first. So we can invite all the people we want? Yeah, invite everybody! Let's go invite everyone! Woo! I'm gonna invite the fire marshal. <laughs> hey, Jeffy, I brought my girlfriend Penelope. Hey! Sweet. You like my sign? That's a pretty nice sign, Jeffy. Hey, guys, I brought the fire marshal. Top of the morning to you. Wait, Cody, no adults allowed! But he needs to make sure the room is up to code or it could be a fire hazard. No, Cody, he's not allowed in there. Come on, you can come in. What? No, he can't go in there! Oh, this club's pretty fucking sweet. Wait, is that a bubble machine? <sighs> Jeffy, what are we gonna do about that? We need to kill yeah, we gotta hire security to make sure no adults come in there. We gotta hire someone really scary that'll beat them up. <gasps> I know just the guy. Junior, why did you call me? I hate you. Well, we were wondering if you would be the security at the new club that we just opened. Why would I be security for you nerds at your nerd club? Yeah, I don't want bully in my club. Well, Jeffy, if we hire him, he'll never be allowed in the club. He'll work outside the club. He'll never be able to come in. Oh, good thinking, Junior. Yeah, we were going to pay you $100. What? Yeah, yeah, okay, for money, I'll do it. Okay, good, you're hired. So here's what it is. No adults allowed. So ask for IDs, and if anyone shows you an ID, you make sure they don't get in, because no adults are allowed. Okay, got it. Also, there's an adult in there Right now, I need you to grab them and throw them out. Okay, yeah. So what's the capacity? I'd say about 25 people. That's it? Yeah, it's a playroom on the second story of our house. All right, old geezer, time to go. What, excuse me, young man? You can't talk to your elders that way. Time to bounce. <laughs> Let me go and stay out. See, Jeffy, I told you we hired the right person. Yeah, good idea, Junior. So, Bully, I made a list of all the people that are allowed inside the club. If there's a check mark, that means they're already here. Okay, cool. All right, so only let the people on this list in. Okay. All right, so let's go. Woo! Woo! This is the greatest club ever! Okay, bro, you can step aside, PJ's here. I'm sorry, what was your name? <laughs> Ladies, you hear that? What the fuck? His name? PJ Crenshaw. Jamie James Crenshaw. Pierre Jamie's Crenshaw. I'm sorry, I don't see any of those names on the list. <gasps> PJ's not on the list? Now, ladies, calm down. I'm sure there's just been some kind of misunderstanding because PJ is on every list. Yeah, well, you're not on this list. Oh my God, PJ's not on the list. No, much on the Listen, bro, if you don't let me into this club right now, no girl is ever going to come here ever again. No, I understand that, but I have very strict instructions not to let anybody in unless they're on the list. Like, those girls can come in, but not you. Yay! Yeah, well, well, you know what I'm going to do? <laughs> bro, seriously? You're a crack of little bitch? That's your only option? Bro, I don't know what the hell are these ladies seeing you. I mean, are you kidding me, man? I know that... I know you're popular with the ladies and all, but seriously, bro, you a crack little bitch right in front of them? Oh my, because your name is not on the list, bro? Like, come on, get the hell out of my sight. You know, I still don't like him because of what he did to Jeffy. I still don't like him. Go Jeffy! Go Jeffy! Go Jeffy! Go Jeffy! Go Jeffy! Did you guys hear PJ Crenshaw crying? Yeah, dude. Hold on, let me go see what's going on. <laughs> what's going on? This guy said I'm not allowed in your club because I'm not on the list. What the heck, bully? Of course you're allowed in, PJ. Uh, yeah, th thanks, bro. Hey, man, you're really lucky he showed up when he did. I was about to F you up. Come on, girls. What the heck was that about, bully? You didn't let PJ in? You said only to let people in if their name is on the list and his name was not on the list. But PJ Crenshaw's the coolest kid in the world. Of course he's allowed in. Well, you didn't tell me that. Oh my God, if you wouldn't have let PJ in, then he would have told every girl in the world not to come to this club and the club would have closed down and went bankrupt. What, bankrupt? Am I supposed to be charging people money to come in here? Yes, you're supposed to be charging guys $20 to get in. You never told me that. Oh my God, so you're telling me a lot of people are in there for free? Yeah. Okay, how about you charge a leaving fee? They can't leave until, you give them until they give you $20. Okay, fine. 
fine. All right, so make sure you let the cool people in. The cool people. Okay. This party's cool, huh? Yeah. Hey, can you watch my drink? I have to go to the bathroom. Okay. Junior, Junior. What? I think we got a situation. What is it? I just saw Patrick dump a bunch of sour Skittles into a girl's drink. He did what? Yeah, look at him. What's he trying to do? I think he's trying to see her sour face, Junior. Or he's trying to get her to taste his rainbow. You gotta let Jeffy know. Okay. Hey, Jeffy, we got a problem. What? Well, kick his ass out! Cause Jeffy is a safe space for girls! And so is my face! Bully, get over here! Okay, Bully, he's right here. Alright, man, come on, your night's over. What are you talking about? Nobody's gonna be spiking girls' drinks at this club. Aw, oh, come on, man, it was just how it skittles. Nope, come on, you're going out of here. No! No, I'm not going! No, come on, man, don't make my job harder. No! Come on, you're embarrassing yourself. Pull your pants off. Get him out of here! Yeah, when I'm in the party, I don't want anybody spiking my drink because I don't know what the hell I ain't drinking. Either it's liquor or wine or anything else that completely will make me waste, that making me lose half my brains or something like that, guys. I do not want that. Seriously, bro, I do not want that. I hope any of you guys don't want that either because I know you want to get lit in this party, but don't get that too much lit or else you're just going to wake up somewhere else that you do not know where you are. To me, I don't even want that happening to me at all. Yeah, get out of here! Fuck you! Uh, hey, my name's Chef Pee Pee. I'm supposed to be catering this club. I got a pizza. Oh, man, you look way too old for me to let you in here. How old are you? Come on, I know your parents told you not to ask a lady her age. Sorry, I can't let you in here, man. What? I'm supposed to be delivering this pizza. You gotta let me in. Well, you could give me the pizza and I'll deliver it. Well, how do I get paid, dumbass? Uh, well, you could ask my boss. Well, where's your boss? He's inside. Well, let me in. How am I supposed to get paid if I can't go in? Sorry, I can't let you in. Uh, well, no way just getting this pizza then. Hey, boy. Did Chef Pee come with the pizza? Yeah, yeah, he came, but he was too old for me to let him in. What? You didn't let Chef Pee in with the pizza? Everyone's hungry. Well, no, because he's an adult, and you said no adults allowed. Oh, Chef Pee can come in for a second to drop off a pizza. Well, you didn't tell me that. The sign says no adults allowed, not no adults allowed except for pizza men. Oh, you should know this. Oh, okay, you know what? If you ever have a question, just ask me, and I'll come give you an answer. Okay. Did anyone else try to come in that you didn't let in? Well, there was this one guy who pulled up with 10 hoes and a Dooney van, and he called himself the Coochie Man, but I didn't let him in, so he went back to Coochie Land. You didn't let the Coochie Man in? No, no, he didn't want to pay the $20 to come in, and his hoes didn't want to go in without him. If a guy pulls up with 10 hoes and a Dooney van, you let him in, because that's 10 hoes. Ugh, there's so many rules you didn't tell me. Okay, listen, if you ever have a question, you just ask me, and if I don't know an answer, I'll ask Jeffy. Okay. <sighs> Junior, you don't even know what the fuck you're doing. You don't even know how this club thing works, you fucking idiot. Seriously, I see your grades. You don't know shit. Yeah, you don't know shit at all. Seriously, that would be a great time to invite the pizza man over. I mean, Chef Pee Pee, to bring the pizza in. Because what 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 party would be without any pizza, guys? What party would be without any pizza? Seriously, it would be a boring-ass party without any food either, guys. Seriously. Like, come on, get some fools into your club so we can have a good time drinking and eating. That'll be all. And also, it is true that boy is doing what he's told. He's, he's doing a pretty good job being a bouncer. I mean, a bouncer. Yeah, doing a good job not letting any adults in and letting the party allowing kids in. Yeah, he's doing what he's told. All of a sudden, they're trying to get him confused. Oh, yeah. I forgot to say in the very beginning, guys. You guys remember in the last video that... Junior kidnapped Penelope. I only know why Bowie's helping them. I mean, you, you're literally the one who got him in jail for something he didn't even do or set up. And you stole Penelope from him. Seriously, I don't even know what the hell is he thinking of helping you. He should be kicking your ass right about now. Like, what is this? An enemy, an enemy is my friend? Seriously, uh-uh. You both are literally rivalries. Oh, well, actually, him and Jeffy are rivalries. We already seen them beating the hell out of each other. Oh. Marvin, I can't believe that man randomly punched you in the face. Yeah, so random. Yeah, why'd you do that, Marvin? I don't know, maybe because you said I said his breath smelled like cat shit. Well, his breath did smell like cat shit, and besides, you're the one who was flirting with his girl. Well, no, I wasn't. Marvin, what? You were worried about me talking to guys and you were over there talking to girls? I wasn't talking to any girls. He was. No. Yeah, huh? Nope. Yeah, yeah, you were. Never. You said you wanted to get head. No, no, I was talking about a coin flip, Marvin. Actually, I should have said, what are the chances I get head or tail? Then I win either way. Oh, that would have been good. I should have said that. I mean, you should have said that. You know what? Karen and I are going downstairs to bake cookies. 
You you hear that loud music? Man, yeah, it's probably just the tinnitus from how loud the club was. No, it sounds like it's inside the house. Hmm. Yeah, you're right. We should check it out. Okay. Look, Marvin, this is where the music's coming from. Club Jeffy? Is Jeffy in there? Yeah, it's his club. Let me speak to him. No, 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 no. You're way too old. No adults allowed. This is my house and this is my room. I'm allowed in. Yeah, well, it's Jeffy's club and he says no adults allowed. No, I'm allowed in. Back off, man. I'm allowed in. <clears throat> oh, my God. Wow, Marvin, hit in the face twice in one day. Well, arrest him for punching me. I'm not going to arrest a bouncer for doing his job. He's a kid. He doesn't have a job. Look, let me try to talk to him. Yo, 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 homie, what's up? Shit, number Swiss cheese. Listen, man, you're not allowed in here. Oh, come on. I'll slip you about tree fit if you let me and my friend in there. No, sorry. No adults allowed. Oh, but there's a bubble machine in there. I'm going to go in there so bad. I hate you. Jeffy! Jeffy! Hey, listen, man, calm down. Jeffy! Hey, quiet. Jeez, what the hell is this? Punchy Marvin Day? Like, what the hell? Seriously. Marvin already suffered enough. Like, come on, stop doing this to him. And also, I don't give a damn what that bitch thinks. Like, shut the fuck up, bitch. You don't want to have too many ex-boyfriends to how much you've been sleeping with them. Seriously, fuck you. Both dumbass bitches. I mean, it is true, guys. It is true. Also, if you guys are having a party and all of a sudden your parents caught you having a party and then all of a sudden they ground your ass or do something worse, like take away your phone and everything because they ground you for a month because they don't want you having a party anymore, invite any of your friends or else you're dead, yeah, they ain't literally going to kill you if you even have a party. Or worse, guys, they can literally kick you out of the house and never let you back in ever again. Party people? These two geezers want to come in. Oh, hey, Daddy. Yeah, you're not coming in my club. Jeff, you can't start a club in my house. Well, I did, and I'm fucking up some commas. We haven't made any money. Jeffy, you have to let me inside this club since it's inside my house. Oh, uh, one, two, three, you don't have to. One, two, three, you do have to. Uh, nah, nah. Don't let him in. <laughs> well, Jeffy, you have to let us in. I said back off, man. Oh, we'll be back, and we're going to find a way in. Come on. Woo! Best party ever. I forgot to charge everybody 20 bucks when you came in, so now I have to charge everyone 20 bucks to leave. Screw that, there's a fire! Yeah! Daddy, there's a fire in my club! A fire? Well, you're a firefighter, go put it out! Well, I mean, I would, but it's no adults allowed. Oh, yeah, Jeffy, there's no adults allowed, so I guess your club's gonna burn down. That's fine, it's your house. Well, he's right, it is my house! Go put out the fire! With no adults allowed. Go put it out! Okay. All right, kid, move out of the way, I gotta put out that fire. Nope, no adults allowed. Are you fucking kidding me? The room behind you is on fire! No, I take my job very seriously, so you're not coming in. What, what are you talking about? If I don't put out that fire, this whole house is gonna burn down. Nope, I'm not falling for your tricks. Tricks? Just turn around! Nope, that's the oldest trick in the book. Okay, you know what? You can fucking die. Never mind, guys. I take back what I said. Seriously. Seriously, boy. You, can you not feel the fire behind you, man? Like, you literally gonna burn to death if you don't get the fuck out of there. There's literally no party going on. The music stopped. Seriously, how you... How you not notice all of them running away from a fire? Seriously. Oh my god. They raised a fucking stupid ass kid. Not only that, but also a man child who literally just ran off because he couldn't do his fucking job. He's letting a kid stop him. Bro, you are a fucking idiot. You couldn't either call his parents or tell or tell him to get the fuck out of your way. Did you put out the fire? No, that guy was an asshole and he wouldn't move. Well, what are you talking about? You didn't put out the fire? No, he wouldn't let me in. What the fire alarm's going off? Go put out the fire! No, no, this is what he wanted. That's fine. He wants to die. I want to die. That works for both of us. Go put out the fucking fire! And there you have everybody. That was Jeffy's Club, guys. I gotta say... I actually like the part of the video that Jeffy's party got lit. Everybody was blowing the roof off this place. Yeah, let's go. I actually like it, guys. I hope you guys feel the same. Yeah. Yeah, that's the only part that's great about the video, guys. Yep. I actually like Jeffy's club, and it was lit, and everyone had a good time. Uh-huh. I also hope in the end that they're, they managed to put that fire out, because I do not want the house being destroyed by a fire just for this video. So I hope everything's alright in the end. I just hope everything's okay. And 100% guys. Because I don't want them to get a new house. I actually like their house being like that. And I don't want it, I don't want it to be destroyed. Or any burnt, any burnt pieces. Or else they're going to have to repair it all. 
Yep. Yes. So I hope everything's all right. Also, why the hell would Broken Guy literally just stop doing your job? Bro, you ain't a kid stop you from doing your job even though you're terrible at it? Bro, you're a fucking idiot. You are a fucking pussy. Not only that, but you're also a menace. Seriously, bro. This is why I can't be around your ass. Because you suck. Uh uh. Yeah, guys, don't you guys read me? Seriously. He can't even do he can't even do a great job now all of a sudden I can't just stop him from doing doing his job. Seriously, that's just fucking stupid. Uh uh-uh. uh. But anyway guys, I'm just really happy to join this reaction video for you guys, so you're welcome. And I'll be seeing you guys later on the next video by SML. Until then, you guys have a good day out there. And I'll be seeing you guys later, alright? So, peace out. Stay pro. Later, everyone. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.